using distressed oxide, salvaged patina, blend with a blending brush on one half of a white piece of cardstock. Then take peacock feathers and blend the other side of the white cardstock. Blend together. Bring back your salvage patina and blend in the centre. Leave this to dry or use a heat tool to dry it before stamping. Using a the Bee's Knees Stamp of the Month from Close to My Heart and a stamping platform, place your cardstock in there with your magnets. Ink it up in archival black ink and you'll probably need to do it again as I have here to give a good stamping impression. Now we're going to add a sentiment. Celebrate every moment is what I'm going to use and I will put this in the stamping platform too. Using archival ink enables us to heat emboss with clear embossing powder and this will give a nice shiny stamped image. So here's the white embossing powder. Remove any stray pieces of embossing powder. Get your heat tool and watch the magic happen as we heat up our embossing powder. It just looks so beautiful with the distressed oxide background. Now I'm going to add so, a couple of extra flowers from this stamp set with the archival black ink as well. Add a, a bit of foam under your stamping to give a good stamped impression. If you stamp off your cardstock there, some more heat embossing with the clear embossing powder, heat again. and our card front is complete. We'll get our piece of card and up some black card stock. Attach to the card front. Then we'll get some 3D foam tape and pop up the um, stamped image. And here we have a quick and easy card. Now admire your work.